Last December, I snuck out of the on-the-water offices with Jimmy Fee and Adam Eldridge to go surf casting for trout. Always fat. Sometime in the fall, herring drop out of our kettle ponds to return to salt water. But strong, sustained south winds clog the herring run with dead leaves, leaving juvenile and adult herring prone to predation in shallow water. In a unique instance where bait was pinned to the beach with nowhere to go, oh. rainbow trout were tearing through the herring schools to fatten up before a long winter. It was a full-on freshwater blitz. Look how big that is. Look how big. We threw hair jigs and metal spoons like Castmasters and Little Cleos to match their forage, and due to the choppy, roiled water, the trout were not shy about taking our loops. These rainbow trout were plump and aggressive, and with the wind in our faces, we had them feeding right at our ankles. But after 45 minutes of nearly non-stop action, the fish caught on to our yeah. presence and the bite shut down. They may not be stripers or blues, but you can't ask for a better day of freshwater surf casting in late December.